Workers of Brastoff are using locations across the Calendar region to highlight the spirit of the people who are working to rebuild their shattered communities. Katie Oscroft has this report. Demonstrations against the government's pit closure program united the region's coal fields. In the biggest protest, the pitmen took their message of despair to London. Now that message looks set to be spread worldwide. St George's Church in Doncaster is one of the locations for Brast Off, a film set against the backdrop of the devastation of the Yorkshire coal fields. While the film set for the latest shoot was being prepared, the musicians of the Grimethorpe Colliery Band waited for their turn in the limelight. They've been joined by the film's main characters who play members of a threatened Pitts brass band that's bidding for national glory. The Grimethorpe Band's one of the best in the world and it's a real privilege to sit in there with them. I uh, hadn't played a trombone before, but uh, I'm getting away with it so far. Oh. I think they know what we're doing and why we're doing it, and um, we've involved as many people as we could. And they've just been generous to a fault, really brilliant. At last the set's ready and the band can take their places. The film details how the people of the fictional village of Grimley battled to save their pit. Since the pit closures, the, uh, those areas seem to be have, uh, have been forgotten, rather. and. Uh, Actually, working in those areas now, you realise the effect that the closures had when people weren't really noticing. And they were very, I'm very pleased to get Grimethorpe. Um, and at the moment, they're easy to work with. But we're only three weeks in, so it could all change. These actors received expert coaching in playing and conducting to be convincing in their roles as musicians. As midnight approaches, over 12 hours after the start of the day shoot, the band members are still patient. Well, it's been a real experience for everyone. We're thoroughly enjoying every minute of it. Uh, sometimes the hours are a bit long, but uh, we're thoroughly enjoying every minute, yeah. It's terrific. With Brast Off set for an international release late next year, the music and spirit of Yorkshire's pit villagers will be given a worldwide audience. Katie Oscroft on the new film reflecting life in Yorkshire during the dark days of the pit closures. The other day we were trying to think of all the films that have been made in Yorkshire. There seemed to have been quite a lot recently, don't they? There was the Sean Bean football yeah, one. The, 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 last the only year. one I could think of was the Railway Children. We but came up with so many the other day and now we can't remember. think of any. Much more important question for you, Christine. Who is going to win the work?